converting the following Denry numbers into binary. And we've got several to have a go at here. So let's move this out of the way. And we'll start with the first one, which will be 41. So I'm going to draw a number line. 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, 64, 100. And 28. Okay, does 128 go into 41? No, it doesn't. Does 64 go into 41? No, it doesn't. Does 32 go into 41? Yes, it does. So how many is left? So I'm going to remove or take away 32 from 41, and I should get 9 left. Does 16 go into 9? No, it doesn't. Does 8 go into 9? Well, yes, it does. Which would mean, if I remove 8 from this, we would only have 1 left. Therefore, 4s don't go into 1, 2s don't go into 1, but 1s do go into 1. So that would be my answer. In fact, I could get away with saying this is my answer. 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1. Because as we know, these two the 1 to 8 and the 64, the zeros underneath, don't matter. They're insignificant. So we can check this back. 1, 32, plus 1, 8 is 40, plus 1 there is 41. Okay? So let us rub that one out. Okay, I'm going to go down to... We'll do 1, 2, 7. We'll, we'll work across the top. 127. If I put in the numbers 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, 64, 128. Well, I can see straight away that I can stop there. Um, and the good thing about this is, because 127 is 1 less than 128, I know that if I added all these numbers together, i.e. if I put 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1 in there, and I needed, and I added 1 across the bottom. If I added 1, I would get 128. But here, I've got all these numbers here, so the answer must be 127 must be 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1. And I can do that simply by going, I'm just going to rub this out, and there we go. So, nice and easy, a lot easier than maybe you, you first thought. So let's rub that one out, and we will have a little go at doing 33,000. Let's grab a pen, write this down here. That's going to be a big number, because we're going to go 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, 64, 1, 2, 8, 2, 5, 6, 512, 1024, 2048, and I'm going to write sideways, 4096, 8192, 16384, 32768. Oh my word. So I'm not going to go any higher than that because that would obviously be 65,000, etc. So let's grab a pen. Let's write down the number. We'll put a one in here and we'll remove, we'll take that away from this number here. Our 33,000. So 33,000 take away 32,768 would give us two hundred and thirty two okay so we can go down here zero 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 one take 128 away from that to give us 104 which obviously 64 goes into which would leave us 40, which obviously 32 goes into, 
which would leave us minus 32, which would leave us 8. So I can go 0, 1, and then I've got 0, 0, 0 here. So the grand total would be 1, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0. Oh my word, that is that one there. Wow, so we've done those three. Superb. Let us have a look at the answers and sit and make sure we've done simply this last one. Okay. So if I bring this into, you can see there, and there are the answers for you to have a little look at. Okay, I will leave it on screen for a few moments. Please pause the video so you can write down your answers and check them against your working out. I don't, I've never come across a, um, a, any questions which converts that size denary number into binary, but that is how you would do it. Again, you can't have a calculator in the exam, so it would mean you've uh, been able to certainly double your numbers and take numbers away from that. Okay, that is it for this video. Thank you very much indeed for watching. I will see you next time.